Hi there learners and welcome to today's video in which we are going to be talking about symbols. Now, when we look at symbols, we need to go to the insert tab. And we can actually go all the way over to the right hand side to the symbols category. Inside the symbols category, we've got an icon that says symbol. And we've got a little down arrow. So when I click on the down arrow, you can see by default, I've got a number of symbols that are there. And depending on what I need, I can simply click on that. Let me just go down here. So you can see, click on that. Let's click on that over there. And it's taking another symbol. And it's taking another symbol. And it's taking another symbol. Okay, so that's what our symbols look like. However, if I need more, then I'll have to click on more symbols. From more symbols, a dialog box will open up. And from here, you just need to know how to navigate through this area. So we've got symbols. We've got the font that people can use. Um, a lot of the times in the exams, they ask you to use the wingdings. Right? You can see these little symbols over here. Also, there are character codes. So they might tell you in the exam to um, insert the symbol from the wingdings to font and character code number 110 for example and you can see when i type it in it highlights that particular character code right so this is how we find our symbols and once i've got it i can click insert and there my symbol has been inserted so guys this is how we insert our symbols just insert symbol more symbols we go to our font if they give us a character code we pop that in otherwise we can just navigate through here and just have a look at everything. 